She just is a trip. She's hilarious. Hey, she's so so well behaved there. It's like she knows she needs to be there. And God, it's beautiful here. Sabrina! Uh-oh. Good girl, Chloe. Take your time, Chloe. Oh, she, it's her. She's got that area. I think it was her. Is there stuff on her face in her eye? Chloe, come here. Wow, is it hot? We're going to have to turn that ass. The uh, sprinkle machine on. What's she doing? She heavy? Good exercise for you. Uh, it's made by canine, I guess. Uh, as you can see the label, um, it's for up to 35 pounds and she's close to 30, if not over. And it's like a straight jacket. It's not really well designed. It needs a, a strap for the chest and the waist. It has a chest the oh, really? Yeah, but I'm, I've got control. Because when I said I stopped, Benji helped me figure out a way to do it. Yeah, it's a box. Hey, Karen. How are you, Karen? Karen's checking up on us to make sure we're not. <laughs> Hold on one sec. That's a. Hold on one sec. Turn around. Okay, turn around. Smile. Let's get her. Sabrina! <laughs> Sabrina! Sabrina! Turn around, Lars. Big smile. <laughs> Serena, smile! So, um, Karen, I, I provided your name to someone who's looking for a silver puppy. I'm not sure when you're 
gonna have more silver puppies, but I tagged you. Um, hi, Julia. Karen says she could never have the strength that you had. <laughs> I don't think I could. <laughs> I, so cute, yeah, I, Karen was worried whether we would, would hike her. And I said, she's going to be just riding in a bag. Yeah, yeah and I got to leave her at home. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. What's that? Yeah. So, Karen, do you have any advice on, um, you know, you can look at the video, you know, and um, I show a close up in the video somewhere of her foot. We didn't see any blood. It looked, looked like it was healing well. Uh, you know, it's just a matter of, um, the, whether we leave it off and get it air. I think we should. Right. Given how hot it's going to be, I think it'll... Karen, that if you want to speed through that last video or I'll, I'll send you the timestamp or if someone can... Karen's the breeder, yes, Cheryl. She did a wonderful job, as you can tell. And uh, must be nice for Karen to be able to see her, her pup grow up and keep tabs on us to make sure we're not violating the agreement we signed, which I, I think said, don't tear her pad off. Yeah. <laughs> you know, please don't tear her pad off. No, 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 it didn't say there. I'm just going to add that to the rules for next time. <laughs> rules don't tear a foot pad off don't tear your <laughs> unless you're you've got the strength of Laura. Um, she's located in near St. George, Utah, which is not far from. Is it close to Reno and, and Las yeah. Vegas or close to nothing? Like Las Vegas. Reno is closer to us. Oh. Las Vegas is like closer to Washington. And she has yeah, spectacular okay. dogs. And one of the things I think she does um, uh, really well with her dogs is she has kids come over and regularly play with them. So they socialize. It's good for the kids and it's also good for the dogs. You know, so they're, they know how to be gentle. She's one of the most gentle teethers. Most of our other dogs, when they teeth, um, right. She knew when, right, that, that millisecond before she was about to break your skin. Yeah. My, my hands were really ripped up from Rhonda. I mean, she does have needle teeth. Uh, her name's above there, Cheryl. Um, Karen Green, and it's Desert Reef Poodles. And uh, they have a Facebook page. And she has some champions that she's raised that are gorgeous. Yeah, she. I think she specializes in silver and white, I, I think. And blue. And I guess if you get silver, you get some black, too. Weren't there some black ones in the... Yeah. Um, Desert Reef Poodles out of St. George, Utah. It is hot. And there's no wind. You should get a second poodle. One, you know, we had one for a while, and we just spoiled. We we just spoiled a rotten, and and you know, I just think it's just healthier for the dog. 
What's that? Yeah, they are pack animals. Yeah, second poodle is much more expensive, obviously, double the cost. But we never wanted to leave Kelly alone. You know, which was stupid, you know. God, this might be the hottest day yet. I really didn't need that Chinese food, did I? I could have done without that. What's that? But the other screwing around was changing her bandage. Oh, that's my fault too? Yeah, Sabrina is enjoying it. She, I thought she would not like it this much. So yeah, it's this or staying at home. Yeah, her paw looked good. I, you know, I didn't look too closely, but... What's going on? Bye, Karen. Karen gave us permission to continue on. She says, while you guys go fit, she's getting a taco. She's looking back at her sisters in the water. She's jealous. She wants to go in the water. Hold on, turn around. Turn around. Sabrina, smile, smile, smile. Come on, you're ruining pictures. Say ha 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 ha. No, I do. I know how heavy she is and doesn't mean you can't smile. What's that? Are you sweaty? All right. Um, I need to, okay. I mean, she's got to be hot. I'll pour some more water on her. Hold on. Here, hold on. Um, Susan, the foot is doing much better. Uh, we unwrapped it and took a look at it. 
We saw a little blood on the bandage. We were worried, but it wasn't bleeding when we took it off. So, Yeah, she liked that water. She hasn't been squirming. She is jealous of her sisters. What's that? Ten more days. Hi, Debbie. Is it really? So 11 more days? If you include today, I guess. Oh, she's got this silly ass grin. How do people camp in with 50, 80 pound I mean, it's odd because it's designed. It, you know, it's it's not designed, but it's it's. it's got some good design elements, but it's not designed to hold the weight. Not at all. Oh, you're right. Bye, bye, everyone. Yay, Margot.